Now, if you live on Football Manager like myself, no matter what nation you're managing, no matter what team you are in control of, most of the players on this shortlist you will have heard of. And that's okay, then this shortlist might not be for you. But if you have not, you are new to football, new to the game, and you want to find some Football Manager Wonder Kids you can sign and splash your cash with at the top clubs, then these are five players for you. One of them is a bit of an out-of-the-box look, so hopefully when we jump forward in the future, he's developed how I hope he will. Oh, no! So we're going to start with the cheapest and work our way up. Lucas Fretas. He's at um, Socio in um, France, and he's only 16 years old. He's a French player. He is valued between 80k and 250k. And I think for a 16-year-old, he looks very, very talented. And definitely someone who I'm excited to jump forward to and see how he develops when the AI is in control of him. Um, but definitely someone you could pick up. He wouldn't cost you a lot of money, and I think he could develop into a really good prospect. The next player is currently on a youth contract, Endrick. A lot of people will have heard of him. He's the talk of FM23. So when I'm doing a well-known wonder kid, he has to fit in the list, doesn't he? Uh, 15 years old, value between 5.4 million and 16.5 million. Definitely, if you are a top club, you should be signing him, put him in your youth team, let him develop a couple of years with the best coaches and facilities and see what kind of a wonder kid you create. The next one also from Brazil, slightly older than 19, Marcos Leonardo is actually linked to some Premier League clubs at the minute. Very, very good striker. 39 first team appearances for Santos already in his career. Value between 6.4 and 19.5 million. So he's going to cost you a lot of money, but again, potential future Brazilian first team player. The next one from Andalex Youth System, Julien Duranville. See, I sounded so French saying that French German I'm not sure which side and elect and most speak I'm I'm messing up Anna but very very talented 16 year old value between 9.2 million and 27 million so he is held in high regard at Anderlecht but with that pace acceleration that dribbling passing the just all-round skill of this 16 year old I understand why they want so much. The final one, playing at Ajax. Didn't come through the Ajax Academy, though. Came through VVV. VVVV, who Loki Doki absolutely loved. Um, absolutely talented winger. Very, very talented. Inside forward, inside winger. Um, naturally on the left, but right-footed. Value between 9.2 and 28 million. He is somebody who I'm actually excited just to jump forward and see how he's developed. So let's jump forward, see how these five players look. We are suggesting five well-known wonder kids. By the way, you can see how long I've spent going through to put together. I've got some lists of other players. And um, it's the 30th of January as I record this. And on the 14th, the 14th of January was when I started putting this list together. So I've got some, there's a, going to be a list coming of some Wonder Kids from Eastern Europe and stuff, and hopefully, hopefully, some players for you. Okay, and the whole time I've been doing this, I've never had the issue where a player completely disappears. So Lucas Fretas, who we recommended earlier, and please comment below if you find him. The reason I'm leaving this in is it just blows my mind. Uh, he's vanished. There's no record of him leaving the club as a transfer release player. There's no record of him as a free player disappearing or anything. There's no record on all transfers of him anywhere. Uh, there's no records on the youth in terms of getting released. He's not in any of the squads. Uh, when I search for him... Fretas. When I search for him, there's only one Lucas Fretas... And he's a 27-year-old Brazilian, so he's not who we were looking for. I am so confused right now, it's beyond belief. But let's move on to the other four. Um, and then at least you'll be able to see how they've developed, shall we? So we're going to look from cheapest to most expensive again. Again, these are players who you could pick up at the start of your save for cheaper. And maybe we move on, maybe they become first choice in your team. Who knows? So, David Kaloko, 
from Ajax. He's not developed as much as I hoped he was. I was excited to see how he developed. Eh, value between 7 and 21, so his value's gone down. He's only played 34 times for Ajax, mainly for the B team. Maybe it's the way he's been developed at Ajax, I don't know. Maybe you could develop him better. If you have signed him, again, let me know below. So the next three have all gone to England. Julien Duranville. A uh, very talented, obviously, Belgian winger. Ended up going to Porto first. Was that... Yes, yeah, so he went to Porto for £26 million, And then Tottenham picked him up for £50 million. Now valued between 42 and £125 million. Very, very talented. Definitely developed into someone you want to pick up. So the next player is Endrick. He is now at Liverpool. Now, again, it looks like he went over to Portugal. He did. For £18.25 million, he moved to Portugal. Spent a couple of seasons there between before going to Liverpool for 44.5 million. And wow. Wow. He's only 21. Only been capped once by Brazil. Um, he's insanely talented. And it actually shocks me he's not being capped more. 21 years old. Only one cap for Brazil. I mean, who's keeping him out of the team? Um, and the final one, only five caps for Brazil for Marcos Leonardo, who actually went to Everton first for 25 million before going for 69 million to Arsenal. And as you can see, he's a very, very talented player. So again, we've found someone who you can definitely move on for profit. Valued now between 79 and 237 million pounds. I mean, wow. Wow. So in terms of well-known players, these four were the ones. Obviously, Fretas was like a outside-the-box one I wanted to throw into this for you to look at. Didn't work out the best, the scene as he's completely disappeared. But let me know if you've signed any of these players. Let me know how they do for you. Let me know how they did if you've then moved them on. Did you make a profit after signing them? Comment below. Thank you for watching. I've been Paul, also known as the Northman. I'll try not to lose any players on the next video, and I'll see you next time.